Hello, this is Paul Hummeler here at Dream Guitars, and this is a Mountain Song Guitars Odalisk model from Ken Jones. Some of you might know Ken, he runs our repair shop here in town and just made me a personal guitar. I have a baritone from him that I just adore. Um, wonderful builder, uh, right here in, just outside of Asheville, North Carolina. And this Odalisk model is sort of an OM shape. Um, it's his own original actual contours, which I really like. It's got a little bit tighter waist, very pretty, very something different. This is the first 12 fret model he's done. So this one's 12 frets to the body, which moves the bridge down into the wider face of the top, just giving more energy. Um, you probably heard me say all this before, but 12 fret guitars, the reason for them um, is just to get the bridge in the widest part of the lower bout, which is how classical guitars have been done forever, so, so that you, ener you know, energize this area of the top, which is really where all the sound comes from. This part of the guitar is a little bit more dead, and this part is really where um, all the energy and sound comes out of. So the 12 fret gives you a little bit more sweeter voice is what I usually hear, maybe a little bit richer and fuller trebles. Um, and of course the left hand reach, instead of being another inch or so out, it's just a little bit closer to your body, which is kind of sweet. And with the cutaway here, you still have full access to the fingerboard. Um, so just a great, great overall design, a 12 fret cutaway in my opinion. Uh, Ken does a hand card bridge, kind of neat. Uh, again, we've got the Venetian cutaway. Two-tone rosette. This guitar is um, Adirondack spruce on the top, so this is really a nice piece of red spruce. The back and sides on this are Tasmanian blackwood, so really gorgeous as you can see. Has a look a lot like Koa. Um, it's got those sort of golden and brown hues to it and some nice shimmer effect as you move the guitar around. Um, and tonally, it has a nice crisp top end, but also a nice richness to it. Ken's done a number of them and with that with that wood, so he sort of knows how to voice it with the top. And guitar building is all about pairing the back and sides and the top. You know, friends of mine say that the back and top fight and how you, how well you get them to fight together is, is the whole game. It's also got a sound port on the side. And then of course, beautiful bevels. So front and back bevels out of ebony. So the guitar everywhere that touches your body and your arm is really nice and soft and you can play this thing for hours and hours and hours. So let's give it a spin.